Hello and welcome to the next episode of the Pokemon Ruby Randomizer's Lost. I am here today to try and get that ball. Nugget. I found a chicken nugget in the desert. Let's see if we can get our encounter here in the desert. We're going to be exploring this bit for a little while. Die ball. I really have to go and collect all the hidden items I've missed. I'm, I'm not really fussed to do so, to be honest. Right, what can we find? Well... Well, what we're going to be doing then is find out if you have Levitate or Clear Body, first of all. You have Clear Body. Metal Claw. Not very effective. Um, Sado Legendary Metagross. Ooh. That is a very tempting Pokemon, I'm not going to lie. In the Sandstorm, though, he has buff defenses, so this might not do anything. Okay, this doesn't do a lot. I'm still going to outspeed you, surely. No, oh, Sandstorm's raging. I'm thinking if I can hit this asshole, maybe I should have taught Spore. Oh, he does outspeed me now. Oh, Lord. <coughs> I was going to try and go for Twister can flinch. Alright, Twister's not going to be any good. Um, mm. Alright. Let's do like for like. Let's go to Clubber. Still resist, still. Don't really resist. Um, you can you scary face all you want, bro? I don't really resist his uh, psychic attacks, though. And he is a Sailor Legendary. Even if he is nine levels under me. So that's not making him do shit to either of us, at least. Uh, we're going to see if we can. Can you live a Rock Smash? I'm guessing the answer is yes. Can I live a psychic move? Yes, I can easily live that. That does nothing. That's neutral as well. That does nothing. That we have to be careful of. The amount of times I've not been able to catch one of these boys solely because they kill themselves with takedown is insane. If we catch this thing, it's a miracle, by the way. I'm not going to lie. These things, even when they started putting... Obviously, you can only get one of these in the game, I believe, post-game, to be honest. Um, they let you have a Beldum post game, I believe. Um, but I think from Gen, is it Gen Four or no, not Gen Four? I'm talking about Gen Six or Gen Seven. You, I know in Gen Seven definitely you can get Wild Beldum. I think in X and Y you can as well. Um, they are insanely hard to catch. They're hard to catch in Legendaries. These guys, they have some. They have one of the lowest catch rates in the entire game. And when they made them a regular flat encounter, I was so mad. Also, if you're wondering, yeah, we cannot also get the defense drop from Rock Smash because he has clear body. Ow. Quit it. <coughs> I mean, it's a good thing, so we don't want defense drops on him, to be honest. Right. Need it up, just to be safe. It's all about safety, bro. Gotta have that protection. Um, right, he's not, just because he's in range of doing silly things with his own recoil. Well, let's try and do some other things. Let's try catching him now. Um, now, time on ball, it's like 30 turns. I don't think it's been 30 turns. Let's just throw a great ball. If he just instant breaks out of this, I'm going to try the time on ball. It's probably the wrong time to try the try time on ball. How is this even rolling? I'll take it, bro. Okay. That's insane. I've never caught a Metagross in one ball ever. I've had Metagross asleep on one HP and thrown like 100 balls at this boy. Can't complain, bro. Can't complain. Metagross, the Iron Leg Pokemon. Metagross has four brains in total. Combined, the four brains can breeze through difficult calculations faster than a supercomputer. This Pokemon can float in the air by tucking in his four legs. Uh, yeah. Um, I'll still call you IQ then. You're apparently super smart. I ain't gonna use him because a bit OP, but if there comes a time when, you know, one of our team members needs replacing because of an unfortunate accident, work 
I will consider using him. I'm just going to go talk to these rocks because I don't know which ones are items and which ones are not. That's a manatine. Manatine. I mean, being relatively fast is definitely a boon <coughs> for horsey, so these are all water types, which is absolutely terrible. Well, that's where we came from before. Now, you may notice there were some weird looking things up here. These things to be specific. It's the root fossil. And the other one is the claw fossil. We're gonna take the claw fossil. It's absolutely random. Remember, this is a randomizer. Neither are guaranteed to be anything. No, the other one fell away. Anyway, we can't get encounters on the, the, the non-lined area, but we can fight people. We go, let's make it for a superhero. We're only get to 32 just so we can have a seizure. Please have something that's weak to water. That is four times weak to water and will do perfectly. And you have garbage special defense, if I remember correctly. So, uh, water gun. I will have another candy, which is a delicious sugar free cherry drop with menthol. Which works very well when you have a cold. Hmm, 32. Well, I don't need to train you anymore. You're at evolutionary level. Um, now we're just training for... Um, oh, my God, I've really forgotten Dad's name. Clive. Keith Clive Johnson. Maybe a Kingler. Is that like... Like, I always, like in the newer games, Leaf Blade just looks like a green sword, just goes shh. But this thing is like one, two, three revolutions of like leaves cutting you. Is, is that what it was originally intended to be? Like, like razor leaf, but they like go around you. Mad. Anyway, Arcanine. We're going to take you on. What time is it? Seven minutes. We got Mona. Oh, Norman. His name's Norman because he's the normal gym leader. There you go. Her name was Flannery because she fans the flames, I guess. Oh, do they all have meaning? Like Watson, I guess, because wattage, electric. Uh, Brawley, the fighting gym leader. And Rocks and the rock gym leader. I guess they all went for pun names. Yeah, yeah makes sense. That was an XP, you know. I got the big dog. What? Horses doing the evolution? Insane. Who could have thought of such things? Um, right, you can go there. I'm, I, I do like to have the levels match. You can go here. So, let's, make, let's fight her. Speed up a little bit. There we go. <laughs> Clefable. Never remember if Clefable's fast or slow. Slower than me? That's all that matters. Oh, it's gonna live that though, it's a thick boy. Oh no, not metronome, please. Nothing insane. Flatter is fine. Fine. It's just swagger for special attack. It's fine. Please don't hit yourself in confusion though. Oh, no. <laughs> hop it? Yeah, we'll swap hop it. Why not? I mean, we're mash up in the head. Yeah, it's kicks. Why not? It's, gonna, it's just a hop it. It's like going to be like 3 XP. I had the little hearts that come out because it was a level ball. Both have to watch that long ass sense of animation. Don't worry, you're getting fire punch back to Gen 2, bro. 
Mm. It looks like kind of like an empty headed tomato creature. More than anything else. I mean, I know it's supposed to be like. Um, Why are you guarding, bro? Pitcher Berry? Magneton. But, dead. Steel Electric. Oh. I need to ground type. Oh. Come be me. 29, look at that. HP attack, defense, special defense. Oof. <coughs> I want to try not to fight these people if possible. We don't really need the levels. That's a crocodile, let's run. Nothing here. Now, if we come all the way down here, you get an item, first of all. TM, I believe. Yep, TM 49. Very nice. Now you may remember I said the Reggie quest. Here's Reggie Rock. There is no door. We have to open the door by going into the underwater temple and activating the doors. Now we have part one of two things we need to open those doors. The first thing we need to open those doors. <coughs> well, actually, we have three things we need to open. We've got two of the three. One is dig, and we have the dig TM sitting there rather nicely. So um, when we need to, we have dig. Speed up, you're not gonna kill me. Run! Oh no, come on, God. Run, car stay, run. There we go. Jesus Christ. No, only for you anyway. I'll spend the episode doing that nonsense. Second thing we need is a relicanth. We caught a relicanth. The third thing we need is a waylord. Now, yeah, we have to go fight Norman. I'm going to fight Norman. It's a pain in everyone's ass. Because I have to come all the way back here. To Morville. May as well heal up while we're here. Just like that. I'm going to have to go all the way back here. Now we could either. Because we don't have Surf. We need to go back here. Do Petalberg. If we had Surf, we could cross this piece of water right here. Um, so our option is either to go here from Morville. To Verdant Turf, through that tunnel, back to Rustboro, right, and go back down to Petalburg. Our other option is to keep going south down here to Slateport, get Mr. Bryony to sail us to Duford, and then get Mr. Bryony to sail us back here to Route 104 and walk back in. Uh, I think I'm going to go the long way through here through Verdant Turf Town. Long in the sense of, I guess, footwork? Because Mr. Bryony just. TPs us across the route, you know what I'm saying, but... Incoming 600 encounters. <coughs> Here they are. And you're just saying, you're not shiny, because your tick's not blue, so I'm going to skip you. Back on route 116. Yeah. They've already fought with these brethren, so we can just run through here. We can cut that as well, use the speed up to make it a bit of process, and get straight through here. No encounters as we hit Rustboro. I could be using the bike, but the bike is um, possessed by the devil, so I'd rather not smash into everything. Back across the oldie bridge. I think that they did realise like this is a bit of a dumb thing to do. Uh, this is literally the quick way back, other than going to Mr. Bryony. You just go down Cycling Road, basically. And then go through the city onto the beach and we'd come out here. I remember uh, you with your asshole Mewtwo, don't worry. Oh, we made it, we're back in Petalburg, hooray. Um, yeah, I think we're good. Now, this gym is set up like a diamond. So in front of us there are two doors. And these lead to two rooms. These all have two doors that lead to three rooms. So there's one, one, and a middle one that both of these will lead back into that middle room. These all then have two doors which lead to two. 
rooms again, and then it's then it's the gym leader. So we're gonna try and take on all of these boys, or none of these boys. And I'm I'm thinking, looking at our levels, we're on par for the gym leader right now, kind of. He's got I think he got 29, 30, 31. We're kind of on par. So I'm gonna try and fight a couple of these boys. Yep. There's no point reading it. It says like it's the. Does it tell you if I go back in again? Speed room. Yeah, kind of, fine. So these guys are all going to use items. So this guy's going to use next speed. I think. He might just have priority attacks on his default Pokemon, but obviously it's randomized, so it doesn't matter. Lily. Well, I'm at a disadvantage fighting a grass rock type. Um, you're not. <coughs> I was about to go with firefighting or just fighting. Oh no, he gave X speed to the Lilip, giving it two speed stat boosts. Nice that Lilip in the generation it came out. That is the root fossil that we uh, would have picked up earlier. Looks less penis y. Yep, that was a magnificent battle. So this is why we might fight all or none of them. So let's see, we open this room. I have what we're going to do. Let's go back here. And we're going to now go in the. Accuracy room. Don't worry, this never relates to you. This is the accuracy room. It's pretty nice whenever a tech lands with FL. So she's talking about her accuracy. They never say like accuracy will be like they're gonna spam sand attack or whatever or double team. Oh god, her, their Pokemon are trash. Their Pokemon are trash. Well, this is neutral, so I may as well. Oh no, it's accuracy. They actually went up two stages. Hooray! Now that spinner rack will never miss. Oh wait, it's dead. <laughs> I mean, this could be anything. This could be Mewtwo's and stuff. The problem is because they have a single Pokemon, their levels are decently good. So now you'll notice that this room, defense room, just as, just for example, if we go back in here, yeah, 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 I'm going to speed room. I've already unlocked it. Yeah, I'm done. That's also the defense room. So start here, this is the zero reduction room. All this is is a guard spec, so we can't lower their stats. Yep. Using the word abilities is wrong when the abilities were introduced in this game, by the way. Oof. Ick. Please don't miss. No, 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 no. This thing has a good Julian HP. But, watch this XP. 1400 XP, bro. What? Your abilities went harm, but you still lost. True. And this goes to the strength room. We're not going to go through it. <coughs> We're going to go through here into the defense room. Now you notice it has two doors. Now the strength and defense rooms and stuff can be a point that can be a real pain in the ass because if she's already got a highly defensive Pokemon that we ain't got a really good answer for. That doesn't count. We're gonna get a free turn because she's gonna use next defend anyway. Lori and the X Defense. Also, 27. Please don't miss this muddy water, my guy. Right, pop of water. And this is a move, by the way, in Gen 6, X and Y. <coughs> they introduced the concept of double typing moves. Oh, yeah, Club of Grill. Hello. The um, Flying Press is a flying and a fighting type move. This should be ground down water at the same time. Can we go back out this way or will it not let me? Oh, it will let me. So we've got the last room on this side, which is the recovery room. Guess what that means? Spamming potion. <laughs> <coughs> yep, yeah, I know how awful it is when you're about to win your opponent restores their HP. I am very well versed in that, my friend. Ah, Dictator is not the thing I really want to be fighting right now. Doesn't matter if you can heal it or not, Kix is gonna come in and sh Well, Kix is weak to Psychic, but I don't think it's gonna have a Psychic move. I think it's gonna have Barrage, Stomp, Hypnosis. Doesn't matter if you use Hypnosis, bro. 
Ähm. Make him kick his ass. Was the thing I haven't mentioned? I mentioned every five seconds. Um. It does have confusion. That's gonna hurt quite a fucking lot. Balls. If I get confused, he was dead. <coughs> All right. If you want to play like that, we'll play like that. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Well, I know it's a super potion, but well done. What are we supposed to do in the meantime, innit? Haha! <laughs> He's in the hill. Oh, I'm gonna bite me again. Oh, you ran out of potions, so he's done. Come here. Sorry, bro. I couldn't restore HP enough. What attack power! Yeah. Fortunately, though, I was not expecting him. I mean, they kind of change it every so often, don't they? Like. The executor will have nothing and then it will have like decent attacks and it's like uh Yes it makes sense. Anyway, we've done this we, have we cleared this round? One hit KO room, yes. Not exactly what it sounds like, and nowhere near as scary unless he does have a one hit KO Pokemon. Um do we still wanna have him at the front or do we have no we don't need him at the front no more. <coughs> Excuse me, Kix is next. Kicks will kick the shit out of you I just like them kicks bro. I just let him kick the Why is it as soon as I bring in my fighting fire type, you bring in a water type? Mm. I know it's water ice, but. Shift? Wait, does that mean that he could have uh, sheer cold? Dire hit? Yeah, that's not what he means. What he means by one hit KO is critical hits. A game with the, the sneakyology. That's not very effective. Cry Chopper, do you? Wall Rain is called Wall Rain because it's a bloody wall. I wouldn't mind having one to put this, actually. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Wall Rain's pretty cool. I love Wall Rain. And that's the gym leader's room, so we can't go in there. We've been in here, so let's use our bag and use another super potion. I just want to keep everyone healthy, to be honest, I'm not gonna lie. Strength room again could be a problem. <coughs> because, if they, again, if they've got a Pokemon with good good physical attack, like her glass cannon. She has a glass cannon, one with high physical attack, high speed, <coughs> who I have to swap out against. Hmm. I can land. I can live one at anything he's going to do anyway. Because you're going to X attack, which is irrelevant. He's a special attacker. The best move he's going to have is water gun. He don't have muddy water. Oh no! See, doesn't matter. He's hitting me with a base ten bubble. Even if it is stabbing super effective, he ain't holding the Mystic Water like man. He ain't got no EVs like man. What are you saying? You thought you could beat me on that? Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> <coughs> Hmm. Um, yeah, that's the last one because this goes to the gym leader as well. Yeah. Let's go. Boom, 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 boom. I'm not even on the hill. Come on, daddy. I don't even know what voice I gave this guy. I actually can't remember. Hmm. So you did get four gym badges. Fine. As I promised, we will have a Pokemon battle. Ruby, I'm so happy I can have a real battle with my own child. But a battle is a battle. And I will do everything in my power as a gym leader to win. Ruby, you better give it your best shot too. Mana, 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 mana. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. Suck you then. Every time. Ooh. Aurora Beam? 
Or it would be hot if I swap out, but that's what we can do. Ooh. Sucks to be you. You know what? I gotta be thankful it didn't go for freaking sand attack. Shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Just shouldn't have said that. Sand attack, quick attack, missed that. That's fine. Alright, what you got, bro? Right, horn. You know what? Chopper needs XP and Chopper can deal with him anyway. It's not a Rai Dawn, it's a Rai Horn. It's Little Man on four leg. What? He done, son. He done. Scary faced ass bitch. <laughs> nah, quite a chop into the chin. That's a weird strategy, actually. You go for the scary face, you can outspeed and then try and get stomp finishes. Okay. I see what they are trying to do. A Jolteon. Our father is a, is a fan of the, the Eons. I mean, this was the first game as well, they didn't have an evolution, right? Because Gen 1, obviously Jolteon, Flare, and Vaporeon. Gen 2 was Espeon and <coughs> Umbreon. Uh, and then Gen 3 don't have anything. Then Gen 4 is Leafeon and Glaceon. Gen 5 doesn't have one, then Gen 6 is um, Sylveon. Ah. Oh, why? Did you do that to yourself? Ah, this spiky dog, bro. He's high level than me, he's 31. Still got one shot though. Damn, son. I... I can't... I can't believe it, Ruby. I lost to Ruby. <laughs> my kid clapped my cheeks. Yes, Dad. I have destroyed you for the first time. And from this point on, you will never win again. Yep, defense raises. You can learn surf. It's time. All right, what's your TM? Petal dance. Mad. Mad. As a gym leader, you can't imagine how upset I am, but as a father, it makes me feel happy and a little sad. It's odd. Oh yes. Well, his parents came calling earlier. They said they had something they wanted to give you, Ruby. These nuts. I believe we got all the rooms. Anyway, let's go see what his parents want to give us. I don't like other games. This game just does not hand you shit. So you have to come in here and talk to his dad. And he's just like, ah, oh, hello, Ruby. Oh, well, he's become very healthy since he went to Verdantop Town. How are you to you? When I left town, you happened to catch a Pokemon, right? I think that made Molly really happy. Actually, not just Molly. It made me, his father, happy too. Yeah, I know you're his father. <laughs> so happy that he's got such a great friend as you. This isn't a bribe or anything, but I'd like you to have this. <coughs> Thank you. It's the only way I can continue the game. We got Surf, baby. Right. I kind of ain't got much time left, but, um... But Surf? Yeah, boy! Snoot can then Surf. Yep. So, Monday Water is 95.85. This is 95.100. Now, I'm gonna get rid of Water Gun because it makes sense to keep two super strong moves on me, but... It's just better than better than that, so... One other thing I need to do, because I cannot remember, because I have smooth brain. Um, shut my PC. My PC, actually. So we still have lefties. I'm going to take lefties out. Um, we do have a wreck handy. Um, <coughs> we do have a miracle seed as well. 
<coughs> which I'm gonna probably take the miracle seed out. Um, deposit item, please. Juicy tooth, black flute, doot doot. I'm just put the yellow flute in there, I don't know. Okay, let's do a quick swap it around. The claw, I want the black glasses. If we can find the dragon scale, we can get, we can get a Kingdra now. Um, right, let's give them their items, what to come out for. Oh, uh, that buffs bite, so it helps us with them, but Miracle Seed is probably better, and I'm gonna give the leftovers to Chopper. A little bit of speed up here. Alrighty. I'm gonna heal up real quick. Here we go. And they may be thinking, what are we supposed to do now? The game isn't on the sheet. Why did I just spam through that like it was? Actually, no, we keep X special? No, we keep X special. Actually, no, I want to sell that Pug Watch bought for no fucking reason. That's fine. Um, so, a little bit of clean up, you may remember, we have Surf now. We can surf, look. We we can get never stone that we don't much want. Yay! Well. Then we can go down here as well. Burn hill. If I remember correctly, there's one to the side as well. Over here, there we go. Amulet coin, not too bad, give us some more money. Not we need it, we ain't really using money. And if you're wondering, yes, we do not have fly yet because we get fly really fucking late into the game because this game's an asshole. I don't think there's anything up there, by the way. No, it just comes out here. That's all little secret bits and bobs. Um. Herma, please. Herma, please. So, the next we need to go up here is Fortress City. <coughs> to get to Fortress City, we have to make our way all the way back to Morville. I remember that route there, we can surf, we gotta go there, and then we go all the way up here to Fortry. Uh, we can also go all the way down here to the bottom of uh, Mount Pyre. Is that, no, what are you called? What are you called? That's that weak graveyard place. But we can go all the way pretty much to the bottom here, but not like, like so far, we can't go up or something, because you're supposed to come down from there and go back this way. Um, I'm going to double check because I can never remember if we're supposed to now surf this route, 105, 106 thing. We already have an encounter for 106 and we already have an encounter for 107. But we can do, I think, 108, 109. See Morville is there as well. Then we can go along that place there. So, um, I think we do that next episode. I think we do the sea routes, really. And then we make our way to Morville and then after that make our way up to Fortree. Then we make our way here to Lily Cove, go do the, the mountain of nonsense and nonsense here, come back here. Then I think we have done, we have to then go all the way back here to Lily Cove to do the fucking stolen. Oh, we get fly by then, at least by the time we get to Lily Cove, we can fly. So, we're, well, Fortry, I think, is to fly. I think we can get the ability to fly and use fly from Fortry, Jim. Then it's Lily Cove, because we've got five badges now, so this will be six. Yeah, then seven's over here. Seven's on this island, right? No, not everywhere. Seven's here. Moss Deep, and eight is here on Sotopolis. So we got a while. We got a while. We got loads of water routes to explore. Oh, God, I hate water. IGN, too much water. <laughs> but that's our plan. Um, I believe we're going to do the water routes. I'll, I'll check uh, a guide or something, see if we're supposed to go there now or later. There's a whole thing of going to pick up items from we, we couldn't get because now we've got surf. We can go. I'm going to go put all that together. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching today's episode. Hopefully, you enjoyed it. Enjoy us next time for more random nonsense as we sort of flail around in the water routes. Now we can swim for once. Um, yeah, now goodbye.